Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. In this video, since I did my video earlier a couple days ago about me getting a Fenrir, this is nothing to be related. I don't even know why I brought that up. But in this video, you guys, I will be testing Fort Columbus, Columbus, whatever you want to call it. Whoa there. All right, I'm gonna test Fort Columbus, low leveled. But here's the main thing, lockdown ammo. This, whoa, what a voice crack there. This um, is an interesting layout. I have ran it recently, like a couple, uh, I ran it yesterday and I'm like, okay, let's make a video about this. This is pretty interesting. And I got my Fenrir up to level five in the couple days. As you see, it's going to level six. And, um, also, not something else to keep you updated on is I have 6,570 Algdun components, so I am on my way to getting my Meta Hanger. I don't need boosters anymore because I already completed my tasks for today. Uh, all I got was 1,000 Algdun components. Pretty helpful because I'm trying to get the robot, but I'd rather get the robot whole, if not even an Ares better. Alright, so let's start out with Moon, a perfect map for a jumping robot, as you all know. Speaking of videos, um, right after this video, I'll have a unedited, no intro, no end screen video. It's just going to be a uh, non-commentary video either. It's going to be the craziest match, the craziest free-for-all match. This battle is actually pretty, that bad, that video will come up uh, very soon after the... After the um, after this video goes up, so once you guys see this video, I would already have recorded the other video, and uh, probably would have been uploading it by the time you guys are seeing this right now. Oh, uh, can this work? Yes. Oh, yeah, perfect. Oh, he fell off. Damn it. Oh, I did not notice you. What is up with? Actually, never mind. I was gonna say what is up with the internet, but really, I'm not lagging at all. This guy missed most of his shots. Wow, I just lost two Tulumis. But yet again, this layout is still great, even without... Well, the main thing is to lock down. That's the whole purpose, to stop the enemies from getting beacons. Not the most damaging, especially with my Tulumis being level 5. But it's very effective from stopping enemies from getting beacons. Or even just helping out your teammates being support. So right now I'm trying to find out what is going on. Like if I can help my teammate, great. Uh, if I could greatly help my teammate here by just throwing a bit of lockdown ammo at them. Is that a way? Yeah, it's a way then. Locking down that spectre would be pretty nice. I'm gonna go up there a bit. In a bit, I should say. How did I get locked down? Oh, from that little itty bitty tap from the Fenrir. Alright. That's a good way to stop him from going into cover. Look at that. Even by just supporting. But either way, we lost that beacon. But we're gaining a beacon somewhere. And we're losing another one. Alright, I'm gonna get out of this robot. You know what? Instead of... Getting out of it. Let's try to get some damage in. Somebody else is also two stops. So this is another stop, as it looks like. Oh my god. Jeez, how are we losing this so bad? I'm gonna try to get a beacon here and there. Alright, our team is getting beacon B. That guy over there needs to get out of that Hydra. It really isn't helping him nor the battle out. If you guys are unaware, I am going, um, I will not be here, I will not be making videos for two weeks, like Manny. It's kind of funny, because every War Robots, almost every War Robots YouTuber is on va is going, or is on vacation. For example, Manny is, well, he is going to, I believe, going to be on vacation. Uh, Kamikaze is on vacation currently, I am soon going to be on vacation for a couple weeks. And 
Um, yeah. Whoa. A nice voice crack there, sir. Um, I'm choosing a target. There we go. <laughs> Let's just choose this guy. Because why not? Let's hop on the beacon. Why? Also. Whoa. That lag, though. Alright, I noticed that guy is behind you. Oh, it's an invader. I don't know what was going on there. Do you know what? I'm gonna drop in with the nemesis over here. Oh, here is the tradition of this falcon. Oh, damn it. Oh, perfect. This is how you outplay an Aries, guys. Look, the shoot. If you have a nemesis. Look, shoot a shield. Even if you take some damage, you're gonna return all the damage you did to... Damn, almost... That full Aries was almost gone. I took out 80% of the Aries. Along with um, a bit of the Orc and Spectre's health. But I also have healing on my pilot. So that's one of the things keeping this thing alive. Alright, when there's a teammate around, I try not to shoot the shield. But once he's targeting me, that's when I go ahead and let it all out. Alright, this is a horrible defeat. Let's try this once again. Hopefully test it out better. Like, get better result test results. Um, so like, can we go battle or... Guess not. Um... Yeah, I really have nothing else to keep you guys updated on besides um, all the stuff that I have mentioned. Um, and the video I am going to be uploading. I also, um, I don't know. I maybe will make a poll asking you guys, what do you guys rather watch? The uh, RCs and War Robots, or just War Robots on its own? Or, I won't do RCs on its own, because I'd rather have mix of things. Alright, perfect match. Uh, map, not match. Perfect map. Making sure none of my... Own clan mates are in the ally or enemy team because last time uh, one of them was in the enemy team and the other one was in the ally team without us even trying to squad. Alright, so let's try to find ourselves a good target. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's a trident fury. Am I not surprised? Come on, man. Okay, this is gonna be a horrible test. Yep. Sorry to disappoint again with this layout. Then I'm always being countered. I'm just waiting for that um, shock train specter over there to collect that beacon if he can. Which I'm sure he will. He's almost there. There we go. Drop in with the tradition of this falcon. Bye bye. I'm gonna play aggressively. I'm gonna aggressively try to get this beacon. Alright, so I gotta start using my ammo wisely, because I know a bunch of people are gonna start dropping in. I gotta leave that space open also for my teammates, because... We gotta take this beacon over. There you go, we got resistance running. We're getting hit by the entire enemy team, and look at us, guys. Okay, now with the help of the Ares, obviously. Man, we're gonna get out. My my goal here is to try to take out everything in my path. Almost done with the Spectre. Can we... Okay, he's done. Alright, we did a lot of damage there. Let's drop in with the Mercury, another damage dealing robot. If I can lock down, which is the main thing. There's really no point in having the hell dive if you're gonna have some people. Uh, you're gonna have people running away. All right, so somebody's also running an Ares right here. So I'm gonna get rid of him real quick since he just uses ability. There's another Ares. I'm just targeting Ares because I these, those are the biggest threats to our team. 
All right, you keep it. I keep hitting him with the lockdown ammo. He ain't with the lockdown weapons. He does not seem to lock down. And now, a couple seconds, he's gonna come out with the shield as long as you remain unnoticed, which is a big factor by the enemy team. Ah, we're dead. Or right, yeah, we are. Um, let's spawn it with the uh, with the nemesis. I normally leave the. What's it called? The Fenrir for last. And soon I'm going to have an Aldun, which is going to uh, replace the Spectre. Spectre is a good damage dealing robot. The only problem with it is, is that it has so low health compared to the Aldun. It has, it is a great damage dealing robot. And it has a decent amount of hit points, which is what I look for in a robot. Alright, shield is ready once again. Oh god. <laughs> We're just rushing up the main base. Alright, now I'm gonna play it smart, but there's really no point. We just dropped in with the Fenrir and a nice victory. Alright. Let's try this one more time. Just get out of here. Wait, can you go into another battle just by... And they can't. I was looking for uh, like a battle button that like says to battle after you win, but I remember seeing that there. Oh god, this actually no, it's not that bad. All right, so we're dropping in with the the Lumbus Spectre Tolumbus Bass, whatever you guys you got, however it's pronounced, I do not know. I will do a great subscriber special once we get to 3,000. Um, expect there to be a special. We are almost there, guys. We are at 2,780-something or 2,700-something. We are almost there to 3,000. And the special one, it's going to be me running the layout that I uh, ran when I was barely starting. And the other thing will be the face reveal. Yes, I will be doing a face reveal on this channel once we reach 3,000. And, um, yeah, I hope, I really hope to looking forward to that. Darmer, guys, my old, super old, uh, well, the old meta was Raijin's. I pronounced it, I, going back to the videos I made, I literally start to freak out. Not really freak out, I start to... Um, cringe at my own videos. Well, not really the whole video. The way I pronounce Raijin. I was like, Raijin. I was like, oh, no, no. What is this, man? I need a... I need better vocals. I need to upgrade, upgrade them to le mark to level 12. I'm just kidding, guys. But, yeah, I do not like the way I pronounce Raijin. Or Raijin's. You know what? I, I, that, that was pretty dumb. I could have used a lockdown ammo. Especially since it has a splash. Woo! I, I locked down two targets right there. Perfect. I mean, like, only if I had more ammo, that would really help out. Yeah, Jesus Christ, Mark II Redeemer. But yeah, the, the Limbus Spectre did do its job. I did not test out. Well, I did test out the lockdown ammo. I was able to lock down two people. And uh, let our team get those kills. Now my main focus is grabbing this beacon and trying to get rid of this of this monstrosity. Redeemer Mark II. That's like my main focus. All right, so he's locked down. So look, just stay under him. All right, so we gotta take cover because remember we gotta face off a Mark II Redeemer. All June, man. Unless it, he's not focusing us anymore. Jesus Christ. The damage this guy is doing to me. Alright, now let's come out with a heal. Give him everything we've got. Alright, can we take the beacon? Yeah, oh, jeez, we're so close. Oh, yeah, we took it, we took it. That's all that matters. All right, all right. Now you gone, you, you gone, fam. You're gonna be dead, or you're gonna 
make me be dead. The lag, though. I need to get. I really want to get rid of this man. Can we lock him down? Give him everything, man. That did not even work. Alright, so let's try to rush up. Once again, we're getting pretty decent victories here. Alright, so there's that, that monstrosity over there. If he get if he hits us with that redeemer and we have our shield up, that will be catastrophic for this man. I'm just trying to get him to come out. Let's get rid of this guy real quick. <laughs> oh god, can we survive this man? No, we did not. But you know what? Now we might. Well, our Fenrir here. We never get to test out the Fenrir, man. <laughs> we never get to test out the Fenrir, but that was not the point of this video. So, if you guys really enjoyed this video, drop a like and hit that subscribe button to keep um, notified when I upload new videos like this when I'm uh, testing out these random setups and seeing if they work. And also, let me know in the comments. Do you like this kind of content? Do you like guys like me running new things and testing out? testing them out with different modules <laughs> just let me know oh and yeah just if you guys wondered here is what i've gotten from the crate my best reward is the fenrir without this event i would not have gotten this fenrir have a freedom ignite or freedom hussar i got the newest mercury pilot uh, jad parks and this is all the rest that i've gotten i got the all doom components today all this is what I've gotten so far. The 600 gold, it really helps me out. And, uh, yeah, everyone, hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. And, uh, yeah, guys, see you guys in the next one. Alright, everyone, I'm out of here.